We should go on a date. Do you like famous rich niggas? I'm also 16. I don't give a fuck. So religion's a fucking scam, and the only reason you exist in this decade is because you're a tax write-off. There you go. What do you do? Fly a plane into one of my buildings? Is that one one? See how your mother's life, that's your sister. On oh, my mother's life. Shit. You mind if I can have your sister? She look good as fuck. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Nah, she mine. No. <laughs> In his very short-lived lifespan, Kick has become for the lack of better words, a very strange place. Featuring some of the internet's biggest degenerates like Neon, Jack Doherty, The Island Boys, Vitaly, Zerka, and even more. Kick, specifically the IRL realm of Kick, has essentially turned into the stomping ground of straight up debauchery from excessive and blatant view botting. I'm gonna be real though. I don't know how the fuck we just went from 17k to 2.7 making sexually suggestive remarks to minors we should go on a date you like famous rich niggas i'm also 16. i don't give a fuck or just completely disrespecting people and being a public nuisance for content you're a fucking whore god suck my dick you're a bitch no she doesn't care i know she don't care but you still don't care damn me up Nah, no, sorry. Uh, oh, she's mad. Oh, fuck. Uh, yeah. Do you have cash app? These guys have pretty much lost connection with reality in exchange for engagement and money. And over time, the already thin line between content creation and immorality starts to become even thinner. I mean, Neon is literally smelling his own dad's ass for views. Yeah, can you get one? Yeah. Oh my god. Hey yo, what the fuck? So anyways, today's case study is Neon and his OnlyFans girlfriend, Sam Frank. For a few months now, Neon and Sam's relationship has been under question over its validity. With several streamers like Sneeko, Aiden Ross, and HS confronting the two over it. I personally don't know or care if they're dating or not, but I do think it's interesting that people will still believe Neon after the continuous lies and staging content. So anyways, both Sam and Neon was at Bradley Martin's Zoo Culture, an ex bang bus failure turned YouTube prankster turned obscure kick streamer. Vitaly pulls up and he pulls up on them with nude photos of Sam Frank from her OnlyFans for Neon to sign. Oh. Now, if it wasn't for this being a content creator gym and literally everyone having cameras, this would have been a decent troll. But obviously Sam didn't think so and she proceeds to basically freak the fuck out. What the fuck's wrong with you? What's up? What the fuck's wrong with you? Nothing. I wanted to get an autograph. Do you have a problem? No, the two plus two is four. Of course, Neon naturally attempting to defend his girl starts barking like the little chihuahua he is. I understand as a guy, you feel compelled to defend your partner from somebody disrespecting. But it's hilarious because one, Vitaly is extremely unserious about this whole thing. And two, Neon is talking crazy while standing behind a 6'6 humongous bodyguard to the point where you can't even see him. What the fuck did I do? Do the one the favor and go fuck yourself. Why are you so hurt, bro? It's okay. So following all the arguments and being separated by security, Sam, probably feeling protected by the security separating the two, proceeds to actually spit in Vitaly's face. And it wasn't a petty spit, it was a legit Jet loogie. I'm a loser. Damn, you're hurt. You're hurt, bro. You're hurt. Oh. We kiss now. Oh, man. Fucking crazy, man. You sound insane. Now, Vitaly is a champ. He straight up takes it and doesn't even flinch. And he is a much better man than me because I would have now this isn't the first time Sam has assaulted a guy while being protected by Neon or more specifically Neon security. The first guy by the name of Sam Bond was slapped in the face by Sam about a month and a half back. And what makes this situation worse is Neon attempting to double down on her actions proceeds to taunt the man about it. What are you sorry for? I'm sorry. What are you sorry no. for? I'm sorry. You're trolling. Um, yeah, I'm sorry for nothing. You're trolling. So go <laughs> Wayne. You switched hey, up. You're no. oh. Oh. oh my God! Say that shit again! 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 Say that sh
say that shit again. Oh my god! Fucking energy, bitch. Oh, what are you looking at? Fucking pussy. Stop, 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 stop. Fucking keep talking stop, stop, shit. Stop, 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 stop. Oh, you oh my the fucking god! god. You're no. the wrong girl. He's going to hell. You shit it. He's oh going god, to hell. You shit it. He's going to you hell. You shit it. You have walk away from him. Yo, yo, let's calm down. Take a picture of that. You do whatever you want. What's potentially good about this situation with Vitaly is that Sam Frank is actually going to be held accountable, according to Vitaly, by way of criminal charges allegedly and i'll get into why i say that in a second she spit in my fucking face bro i'm i'm gonna save the internet everybody wants her locked up and i'm gonna do the good job i'm gonna clean up the streets today i am going to the police station now to press charges but like me and many others people like neon jack doherty and in this case sam frank has been long overdue for a nice ass whoop and i'm not wishing violence on anyone but i am a firm believer that the energy you give out is the energy that you get unfortunately for jack and neon they are both men and men can't talk or act crazy like that for too long without facing some type of repercussion oh, oh. We can't bust. A whole... But Sam being a woman, along with men not really taking the situation that seriously or having too much pride, leads to someone like Sam Frank to walk around assaulting men and not facing any repercussions for it. So hopefully this isn't just some big clout chasing move by Vitaly and he actually does go on to press charges. Now hilariously, the guy that Sam slapped first sam met up with vitaly and essentially formed an alliance where they both agreed to press charges on sam <laughs> nice no but seriously uh, so what happened i mean i went to do the same thing you did kind of just like troll fuck around yeah and, shit, and then she actually slapped you yeah yeah have you seen it i think so on hollywood boulevard yeah it was on hollywood yeah yeah i saw it. that's yeah. fucking insane what is but that i already is? have i already got one but how long has it been bro has they it's been like a month a month are you following you're not following up though Nah, I need to. Let's ah, see? So we're going to follow up together, okay? Let's do it. I'm going to get your number, yeah. we're going to team up, and we're going to lock her away. Hell yeah, we are. That's right. Sam Hell Frank yeah. is going Hell to jail. Yeah. Now, to be honest, I have no idea how real this is. The LA streamer culture is full of fake people, fake views, fake stunts, fake girlfriends, fake beefs, fake religious people, and just like fake everything. So it shouldn't be a surprise to anyone if this is just a stunt by Vitaly and he's just trying to get some clout. But if it is real... Good on you, Vitaly. And as for Neon, it seems like his content is already on a downward spiral after constantly getting exposed for view botting, various fake stunts, or just generally being an intolerable human being. But it does not help your career to get in a relationship with someone who is equally, if not more, intolerable than you. Neon is young and still has room to grow, but he may be in his career before he can actually have that revelation. Anyways, hopefully you guys like the content. Leave a comment down below whether you liked it or you hated it. I read all comments. More content coming soon. Stay tuned. Peace.